You're watching Suck Professor. Hello, everybody. It's me, Hank. Welcome to Fallout 4. Oh, man. I'm in. I'm jacked into this machine here. I'm excited. Got the recording thing going. And here we go. There I am. There's my guy. Look at that face, huh? I think that's an assault gas mask. Got some cool, uh, looks like Frankenstein fingers on his belt. Neat little arm pads that uh, will definitely not get you through airport security. And uh, overall, kind of, kind of feeling it, man. Uh, so I, um, I, I got to admit, guys. I uh, let's get back to first person. I cheated on you. I cheated. I'm a sinner. I violated our vows. I played the game without you. Uh, really, that's more like I jacked off while you were out of business trip. But I had to, and I said I was going to anyway. So honestly, it's uh, our relationship is strong because it's built around honesty, trust, and light butt stuff. So here we go. I spent some time getting to know the inventory system and sort of um, getting a grip on my uh, all my items and stuff. I don't. I wouldn't say I have it all figured out right now. I still have quite a ways to go. And in fact, uh, I'm, I mostly clarified what I don't like about the inventory system. It's a flawed game. Let's be honest. There's a few things in this game that aren't great. However, it's overwhelmed by the positives, and I'm still calling this an A plus. Great game. So. Flawed game. It's a, okay. Yeah, it's, I was gonna say it's like a porn star with a scar. All right, what the fuck's wrong with me? Um, so let's uh, let's get into it a little bit. I'll show you what I did. I'm not gonna waste too much time. I found there's some stuff we gotta do, some exploring. But uh, I, you know, I don't want this uh, playthrough to be overwhelmingly menus. I know it's a slow game, and there's going to be a lot of menus, and that's okay. Uh, but uh, I had to get used to it first, so that when I'm in the menus, I'm not just sitting there and going, "What the fuck? Huh? What's that?" Uh, which is also like the worst thing you want to hear your doctor say right before surgery. So I let go to the equipment here. I um, got rid of a bunch of weapons, um, scrapped it. So my, my I'm pretty loaded up on, on stuff to build a base when I get around to finally doing that. But I want to advance the story a bit more before I do get into the base building stuff. So here we go. I'm just going to give you a rundown. I renamed some things so they're a little bit more sorted inside sorted. Like since it sounds like S-O-R-D-I-D. -D. All right. So combat knife. I've got two melees. I've got my combat knife that's fast with 13 damage my, and my uh, machete for 21. It's actually a DVD of the movie Machete starring a uh, pockmarked face uh, guy. Uh, Molotov's grenades got a few more in storage pistols. I got two pistols. Here's my pistol regular. It's 22. It's modified. It's pretty good Not a bad gun and uh, can I inspect this thing? I can hit that button. There you go. Oh, yeah, so uh, it's uh, hardened Now one one complaint. Why does it just not have an indicator over here that I have hardened? Activated it should it should sort of make that clear so you kind of know what you're working with Unless that is everything that is. Yeah, I'm an idiot. I take it. Oh, God, I'm dumb. That is exactly what this is. <laughs> so it's the whole thing. For some reason, I was assuming these were the categories. Because in the in the uh, modding screen, there's categories look very similar to that. Oh, God, I'm stupid. How did I ever get into Harvard? The answer? I didn't. But you believe me, you trusting fuck. Okay, so um, that's one gun. The next one is this guy. Pistol glow Glow sight with a hair pipe. <laughs> it sounds like a weird uh, bong. Um, yeah, these pistol weapons are pretty neat. They're very, very apocalypse covered with tape and metal and wood and springs and wire and shit. It's kind of cool. Digging it. Digging it. And there's this butter knife here, which is kind of neat. So this thing's a hair trigger, which means it's got much faster um, shooting. And I, I, part of why I'm taking my... Uh, I'm a little confused and not sure... Um, with all the guns and stuff, but I, I have a little clarity on it, is I don't know what kind of gun I want. And I realized that I think recoil is sort of going to be my goal. I think that just means you can take, you can accept slightly less damage with a weapon, but if you have good recoil, meaning low recoil, you can hit multiple times on your target. And, you know, I'd rather hit a guy twice with two tens than once with one nineteen. You know what I'm saying there? <laughs> Gosh, how come the girls at the bar don't fuck me? Um, so let's uh so there's that okay let's keep going um heavy pipe gl rifle glow bayon <laughs> it means it has glow sights it's a bayonet when you rename stuff it doesn't give you as much room as if when it names its stuff itself it's uh, it must be something i hope that's something they fix so this is just my um heavy standard rifle 1455 fire rate not bad gun um shotgun i haven't done any modifying on this thing yet i think these are all the standard mods so far 
uh, I, th I will soon. And uh, now this guy here I kept because it's a bolt action. It shoots very low. It takes 308s. I don't have a lot of ammo. 34, and I haven't done anything yet. I think this is a good base for a, a cool sniper. What I had before was this gun was my sniper. I put a scope on there. It just wasn't doing it for me. I just wasn't, you know, it was like, I mean, it was working, but I, I needed a rifle. I wanted a rifle that didn't have a scope on it because that can be problematic. So I wanted, I wanted two pistols, a rifle, a shotgun, and a sniper. Uh, did I just... Yes, yes. So so now this will be my sniper build for this guy here. And I also have a laser gun, but I don't know if I'm a fan of those things. I think eventually those are probably worth exploring because they're pretty cool. They're just they're just fun and awesome. Um, don't bring them to school. Don't. Oh, 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 boy. Don't do that. It's uh, just bring your willingness to believe everything they tell you. Um, all right, now... That's all I got for the weapons. Okay, tab exit. All right, so that gave me a little bit more. Uh, so I have a bit more sense of what I'm working with as far as this goes. And I also went through and did some uh, looking at the armor. Got a grip on it. I have all these chest pieces and stuff. And so here's a, here's what's going on. I'm not going to show you everything. But what I'm working towards is I, I've noticed these leather, when you mod them, they can get you can get higher damage resists and electricity damage resists. Uh, with leather stuff ultimately so I'm gonna work on modding the leather stuff and the goal see the G that stands for gold is to the max one which is studded honestly I don't know why I wrote that. I also think I'm a big stud a I'm a pimpin stud I'm a big old big old pimpin stud when I go to the bar and I accidentally rub my belly up against some girl's elbow and I'm like fuck yeah fucking scored um, so but I, I need a I don't have this mod right now. I could put it on, but it, it's one in three damage resist. Oops, one in three over here. So that's why I have the tempered right arm currently because it's three in three. So 21 to 23 total. That's pretty clear. All right, so let's do it, man. Let's fucking get out there and do some shit. I I, uh, I dropped a bunch of stuff off, so my I got some room to pick up things. I, Real quick, we're gonna stop off at the cooking station, and then I noticed a, a little secret that's night right, right, right close to home here. So we'll go there in a second. See what I got with the roasting. What do we got here, buddy? Oh, I feel like just like Gordon Fuckface Ramsey ribeye steak. That'll be good. So this will give me one ten solid. Oh, level up. That's badass. That is great. Merlurk meat. Um, hell yeah. Uh, I, don't, I didn't even see you. Oh, 70 and 10 AP max. These food things, I think they give you good boosts. I'm gonna have to start getting getting good at using this. Use, uh, actually, remember, by getting good, I mean remembering to, that they're options before fights. So, all right, we leveled up though. We gotta do this, T. So, you know, if you've watched closely, I have a tremendous amount of confusion about all this goddamn, this whole thing, man. Like, even now, where does it say I have a point to spend? You know what I mean? Like, oh, I guess there's enter, choose one. I suppose that's it. But it, it just, the whole thing is I didn't know each star is what it is, no matter what. you can I can opt, I can increase one of these if I want, or any one of these if I can. And it's that simple, but it's just confusing because it gives you the options at the bottom for alt and control. If you see the letters down at the bottom there. And what those are, as far as I can tell, uh, is it just lets you see what it does. It doesn't actually stay, so it's not, so if I, that's at f uh, full five stars, mouse off it, back on it, back to the one I have. So, all right, all right, that makes sense. So here's the deal. I uh, I think I'm going for, I like lockpick. Uh, I don't have level seven yet. So uh, another good one that I seem to have noticed in all my gun modding, the two that I need to choose from are gun nut, or um, armorer, so that's the other one I'm looking for. There it is, gun nut. Okay, shoot first, kill first, so I can make some better gun mods. That's probably the one I'm gonna do, but I wanna see armorer, which is in here somewhere. And if I've already gone past it, you're probably freaking out going, you missed it! Fuck! Why am I watching this YouTube video? Oh, hey, check out my new uh, Fallout 4 trailer breakdown. I made one for the launch trailer, you know, because I'm a brilliant marketer. What you do, they teach you in marketing classes. Wait till something's time is passed and it's overwhelmed by newer and fresher content 
and then put about 40 hours of editing into a project and then post it on Reddit and have it pretty much ignored by everybody. <laughs> Armor. All right. Level one. Okay. Um, hmm. Do I want to go better armor? Now, the thing about armor is you can do pockets and shit. Although, I don't know. I think I might already be able to do pockets. Oh, all right. I'm doing it. Ah, fuck. Okay. Um, I'll do armor. I just got to pick one. Enter. Choose. Did I pick it? Enter. Accept. Yes. All right. Nice. Hey, 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 look at this guy. Uh, can I zoom in? Wow. Yeah, so check out the Fallout 4 uh, launch trailer breakdown. It's very similar to the other ones. If you came to us uh, th through IGN, or Jesus, IGN, TGN, uh, we've uh, I've kind of been working with them a little bit, and uh, they posted some of my videos, which is really, really great because their audience is giant, and mine is tiny. I'm like a toenail on a giant, and they're like a, well, they're a giant. <laughs> <laughs> all right so yeah that's cool all right um well real quick i actually cleaned up this little room a little and moved some stuff over here uh leather arm let's see what i can do hey look at that. oh i can go studded nice cloth leather adhesive so man i just don't know how much damage and energy resistance stealth and dark areas what the fuck Overall, it just has higher stats tab to go back. Pocketed. That's, I think, the one I want. I don't know how much. Um, braced. Melee. Who needs to worry about that? That's, that's outrageous. Lighter. That's probably pretty good. Can I do multiple ones of these? All right. So let's do... We're going to do pocketed. I'm very curious. It doesn't say how much it goes up. So we're going to back out and just check it. Tab back, back, back. Yes, exit. All right. So I have 250 total, 131 out of 250, and now let's see what it gives us. I hope it's pretty good. Pocket it. Uh, yes. All right. So it's activated. Um, now I'm not wearing it, so I believe I'll have to put it on first. Let's see. Q. 250 leather armor 255 <laughs> I guess that's something there's been times where I've been close enough to the edge um, inspect uh -huh. oh I have to go here to rename it you know because who doesn't put pockets on their shoulder pads um, all right rename it doesn't oh rename press T leather right arm pocket uh, yes, that's fine. I'll do plus five. Ah, there it is. Plus five. And, um, enter or just leave? Okay. Back, enter. All right, man. I knew those sewing skills would come in handy. I remember middle school taking sewing class. I made a Chicago Bulls pillow. My mom still has it. And sometimes she points at it and cries and says I was cute when I had hair. And I say, fuck you, bitch. I hope you die of baldness, too, like me. All right. Um, oh, yeah. Let's make a sniper. That's the plan with this guy. I, I saved this for you. I wanted you guys to be here for this moment. All right. Modify. So it's kind of a shitty-ass, ugly-looking weapon as it is. Doesn't look. Does that look comfortable to jam into your shoulder? Take a recoil from a giant 308. 308's a pretty strong hit, right? Oh, you know what? That's just, so I have a sight. I... Wait a minute. Okay. I I know you can have mods that are, like, independently... They're items. In the pit boy Um... There it is. Mods. Pipe gun short scope. So I should be able to just apply that. Mods going to be attached to the workbench. Craft. Okay, I think I can. I like that you can do that. Um, muscle? No. Uh, sights. Okay, so short scope. So look at right here. Why do I have to make it? Is this not a pipe gun? Maybe it's a because it's bolt action. It doesn't count. That might be what's going on. All right. So right now I have seventy-one. This goes up to 87. Better focus. Um, 
Only uses one screw. Screw seems to be pretty rare, so I'm gonna be keep an eye out for those. I'm going. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Nice. All right, cool. And then let's see. Just get a quick look at what sort of options. Let's see, this is all gun nut rank one stuff. I've got these two here. Okay, standard stock. Damage is 34. Recoil and whoa. Wait, grip and stock. So I already have basic. Oh, okay. So I, I have. It's better than grip. It's further down on the list. All right, good. Barrel. I have a short or stub barrel. Short sided long. Two screws. I'm just going to hold off. I just really wanted the sniper. And then, uh. Yes, enter, exit. So let's get a look at that. There it is, see? It's pretty good. And it's a strong gun, but I don't have a lot of ammo. 17 ammo. Alright, so here's the, uh, the special surprise. I'm wearing lingerie. <laughs> oh, 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 the zipper got caught in my pubes. Um, haha, ha, just kidding. Here's the surprise. Look! My gas station has a butthole. Check that out. Beautiful. Uh, unfortunately, there are no Costco's in the apocalypse, so we don't have toilet paper. So I'm going to have to go in there myself and root them out. But meanwhile, we're going to loot it, take some stuff. A brain fungus. What the fuck is this? A table? Wow, there's all kinds of stuff out of here. Coffee cup. Oh, man. Can I pick it up? No. Sweet, sweet junk. So, I don't know. Oh, it's a loader. Oh, man. Hey, this might actually be a whole fucking video. I thought I was just going to go in there and cap some mole rats in the bitch fucking ass, but turns out we got our first dungeon. Kind, kind of. I mean, I guess that's the, uh, no, that's, the, that's the exit. All right. Quick save, although it probably already saved. Ooh. Brain fungus. Fuck yeah. It's like cereal. Looks like, looks like. Why did I say cereal? I meant to say if you eat it, it makes you smarter, like cereal. Oh, you know what? Let's squat down. I haven't used this gun. No, that I have. I haven't, this is my new pipe pistol. Which, uh. Ah, crap, they noticed me. Oh, jeez. Ugh. This whole swimming through the dirt shit is kind of a ridiculous. I mean, you gotta. Ah! Fuck you, bitch. You know what I'm gonna do to this fucker? Oh, wait. I can't. Ah! Oh, whoa! Look at him. Oh, man. Ah, oh, gingivitis up the ass. Well, really, technically up the mouth. I had that once. I was like, dentist, look at my ass. He goes, yeah, you got plaque. So he took a big scraper and he just... It wasn't a scraper, it was his, his, you know. <laughs> um, cool. All right, let's, wow, this is kind of neat. Bottles! I'm taking everything, though. That's the problem with this game. I'm not going to say problem, that's not the right word. I read an article, a guy on Eurogamer wrote about um, whether he doesn't like the encumbrance factor that you easily get encumbered. And his point, which I agree... Although I don't necessarily echo, I get meaning I get what his point is, is that you're uh, because all the loot, everything has value. They they unlike previous games, every piece ooh plungers, every piece of junk you can take actually is useful because it ends up in your scrap pile and you can use it to build stuff. Your uh, compulsion is to take everything, and it sort of forces you to just grab everything which I I I like that part I'm kind of like that anyway and um, but he was saying that you end up getting encumbered so quickly that when you're in a basic dungeon you end up having to leave and fast travel and leave and fast travel and it becomes really annoying and I get what he's saying some of the comments were res responses were well it, it's not realistic to just take everything you shouldn't be taking all the armor you find or all the guns you find and you know and his response all right first of all let's check out this stuff Short pipe bolt. I already got one, bitch. Um, 
his response was, uh, we accept all kinds of, ooh, melon. Um, realism is out the window anyway, even when you're carrying 10, you know, five, six guns and all the ammo and even at, at the basic weights. So uh, the other option people were saying, I've already been in this room, um, are uh, to, oh shit, I'm getting rads. What's my rad resistance right now? I want to actually be kind of deliberate about that. That's uh, it would be in the stats section. Fifteen. I don't think I have anything I can put on. Pretty sure I don't. Um, you can change uh, codes. Enter a thing in the console, which uh, uh, causes your clean black scene. Yeah, I got nothing. I already have this. Actually, is gas mask is fifteen. All right. Uh, it to increase your weight to a thousand or I think to anything you want. Okay, enough talking. I need oh good fusion core. I'm just gonna go through faster here. See what I can find. What? Mr. Benson, on behalf of the Boston Regional Office, I would like to congratulate you and your team on winning the 2076 Trash Busters Award for a great year to year waste reduction by a single store. Respect for the environment is an integral part of our corporate image and we appreciate your innovative efforts. Wow. Oh, pipe pistol. 10 millimeter rounds. Nice. I'm taking lots of radiation. And I'm looking around as fast as I can for stuff. Ooh, fish bones. Um. Okay, I came in this way. I just went there. I'm already going over there. Yeah, so there's that. I don't know. It's an interesting thing to think about. Because I definitely want to pick up everything. So here we go. Let's get focused. Okay, I knew this wasn't that wasn't the end of the game. So I think what they're saying there was that that letter, the uh, gas station owner. Ah, crap! Is a real piece of shit. And this is like my joke about. Whoa, what's up with the hands? Motherfucker! Oh, he's rabid. Didn't realize he wasn't dead. Um, what the fuck? Whoa! I'm covered in some sort of silken. Was it just a temporary effect? My health is super fucking low. Um, we gotta eat some shit here, man. Actually, let's take a rat away. Eight. Uh, that the owner of this place must uh, must be. This was just jamming his uh, garbage in here. So, like I said earlier, this is the the, the gas station's butthole. In fact, it's the... Let's go sort by value. That's probably easier. In fact, it is the gas station's butthole. It's like the gas station's colon. Just garbage and garbage and... Son of a bitch! All right. Right away. What does... It, oh, 300? What is my rent? Oh, I'm over 400. Okay. There it goes. Do I get to watch it work? Uh, I think that should do what I was hoping for. Potato crisps! Get out of here. All right, let's get to eat. Let's eat some food. Sort. Value. Weight. Bloat fly. Oh, rat will be good. Um, there it goes. The rat away and the health is going up. Very good. Okay. Pelvis bones. What if it's an Elvis Bones and it's like you slowly get to rebuild a, a, a Frankenstein Elvis? What do I do with brain fungus anyways? I, I hope that's a cooking. Okay, I see a safe. Hopefully something nice is in there. Meanwhile. Garlic? Are those barnacles? Ah, a teddy bear. Can I pick them up? Apparently not. Coffee cup, of course. Okay, gold watch. Hey, all right, let's get a look at that guy. Whoa, beautiful watch. Wow, I've seen some hot chicks. I could see a hot girl wearing that, you know, and they wear those big plastic bracelets. Oh, 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 okay, I gotcha. Oh, come on, what a pocket watch? What am I, a pedophile? Give me a break. What am I, a scalpel? <laughs> what am I, a pedophile? Give me a break. Shiny. Is 
like one of those 50 scaffolds that the uh, cheap dentists use. Alright, let's try this. Take a crack at this safe. Novice, give me a... <laughs> I almost said give me a break again. <laughs> ah! Yes! Fuck yes! Alright. Take. Gold watch. Jet 2, yes. Molotov cocktail. And a psycho. Okay! Considering we're still in the tutorial phase of the game, that's pretty good. This was the boss of the level. And I... I fucked him up real good. <laughs> what is that? Yeah, that's garlic. I don't care what you say. Maybe there's vampires down here. Alright, stand up and run. Alright, that was fun. I had a nice time doing that. How about you? <laughs> Let me know. <laughs> Did you enjoy me penetrating the hole? Hmm? Did you enjoy me... Putting on a special protective suit and wedging. Whoa. Smoggy or cloudy. I love this. Oh, the atmospheric shit is so good in this game, man. Wow. Fucking shit. This is cool. I was wondering if that weird yellow storm that's like radiation filled is the only one you get. Oh, who left this open? What am I paying to cool off the entire area? Take the telephone, of course. Sorry, I haven't quite looted my whole area. Money! Boston Buggle. Cabinet. Nothing, nothing. Don't you dare touch that radio. Pegboard. Alright, let's go dump off some of our crap. And, uh... Store all junk. Also, I want to get rid of some stuff I just picked up. Uh, store. Store. Let's, let's keep five. That's probably good. Probably probably should hold them on, on to all of them. Store that one. Those are the same ones, except one has the scope. Okay, which is the one I made. Store that. I believe that's all my stuff. Cool. Wait a minute. Oh, wrong button. Oh, for God's sakes, what the fuck's going on right now? Workshop. Transfer. I don't think I picked up any of this stuff. Oh, I can get rid of this guy. Just store that for now. So some of these items, I don't want to break down. I kind of want to, like, decorate, you know, when I finally build a thing. Uh, no, don't need that. All right, well, we're heading out. What's the next test? I'm trying to remember where the hell I was last time. So I cleared out Concord. I didn't quite, I haven't quite done everything in the museum yet, but I'm going to leave that for now. I want to move on to the quests that I have to get to, uh, which are, let's see here. Data, data, data. No, no, no. Hit the right button. Okay. Um, Preston Garvey, that's later. This one. Eventually we'll head off to Diamond City too. And Bobby is far away. Ha, <laughs> look at that little animation. That's hilarious. And he runs inside there. It'd be funny if in that little window it showed him like making out in the balcony. Making out on a balcony? Let me, guys, let me vouch for this. I once did it. 23 floors up. <laughs> it's weird that I remember that detail. But, uh, fun. I'm just gonna say it. Straight up. Fucking blast. Then we had sex on the balcony, which was even better. Uh, map. Yes. I remember something with this Olivia stuff. Okay, we're heading off that way. Spooky, man. Spooky. All right, guys. Uh, pick it up on the next one. Hit the like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for doing that. It's a huge help to the channel. And I hope you're enjoying this playthrough. I'm having fun. And, uh, uh, you know, there you go. I love this car. When I become a billionaire, I'm going to pay somebody to build me this motherfucking car right here. It looks like the 1950s had sex with a piece of Halloween candy. Alright, good night. See you soon.